we'll just go out for a bit. Hello, that's a bit rude. Welcome, just going out for a bit. It's going to be an interesting one. Stay with me. How you doing all? Welcome to my woodland glade. Nearly mid-September and water's not quite kicked in yet. We've had about a week's worth of rain. Um, the sphagnum moss, as you can see, is starting to go green again. And there's no water colours yet. So, as you can sort of see, we've got the hammock out. And this is to do with lessons learnt, really, from my last attempt at hammock camping. Remember this thing? Remember how much I raved this was? You've got to see an, an old video of it. I'll see if I can put a link somewhere, if I can work out how to do it. Anyway, this thing. What a load of rubbish. So. This is what I, what I decided to do. So, what lessons can we learn from last time? Don't buy, don't try kit until you've tried it out in the garden or something. Okay, listen, listen to recommendations and see if you can still solve the problem. One way, one tigress under quilt. I'm gonna give that a quilt, give that a try tonight. I've had it up in anger once just to try it all out, make it all fit, fits, and yes, good. The second one is this. This is the Austrian Sniper's Sleeping Bag. Available from your most favourite Finnish surplus outlet, Verdostekula. I hope I said that in the correct Finnish accent. This thing, quite hefty, but it does the ticket. Remember I said I want something which I can move around, move my arms, move my legs, okay? Generally, wriggle, wriggle, wriggle. Well, I can do it with this one. I need to get it out of the bag. Okay, not the smallest thing in the world, but in its glory. That is what you get folks. For your head. For your arms. Zip goes down always down, down to the bottom. So you can stick your feet out. Now, unlike uh, what we shall not mention, that horrible thing, this thing is thick. It's thick. I want to do a breeze test with my own breath. 
I can't get through it. So I think this should be just the ticket. Again, veil from Burris Decula. And I've not seen it advertised anywhere else. And to be fair, I've not seen it on YouTube. So this is a, a world first. So we'll see how we get on with all this. And um, I'll get things set up throughout the night. I'll do the under quilt. And we're, yeah. Yeah, so I reckon it'll do well. Um, weather today, it's quite warm. Um, I'm not on top of a, on a scarp, but I'm in deep in the woods. So, I'm going to be snug as a bug and as a rug, so to say, which I've said that before in another video. But, you know, that's how we get on. Okay, we'll do some jiggery pokery and set everything else up. And um, I'll even get in and you can see what an idiot I look. Okay then, join me in a minute. And that wasn't even fast forward. Easy peasy. Easy peasy indeed. Right. So. The one tigress. Under quilt. in all its glory. Nice multi-cam. We'll do a distance test in a bit. I've done a, a breath test to get through the fabric. Can't get through the fabric, so that should stand me in good stead. And all I can do is put my Aldi quilt um, in the middle. Few things to be wary of when I've, I've got this. The carabiners are like that. Very, very flimsy. And one broke. So they've been replaced. If you notice as well, the elastic 
isn't the best quality so that might need to be replaced by me but hey ho these things are here to learn from and improve on again another carabiner so hammock camping looking good looking good indeed Now this is what you pay the big bucks for, eh? You come on YouTube and see me like this. It doesn't get much better. It doesn't get much better. So, here we are. All good. I can move about a bit. Got the ability to go in outside zip myself up as, a, as per a normal sleeping bag but to pan down got my feet free I'm not freezing tonight. Not at all. Lovely, absolutely lovely. But if anything, I might be a bit warm, but I can just unzip it and it becomes a blanket. All the way down. Superb job. Right, until the sun goes down, I think I deserve a nice little cup of coffee. Come and join me. Perhaps after a, a little nap though. Oh. So as you can see, the Austrian Sniper sleeping bag has zipped all the way down the front. Down the bottom. Very good. The zips can be done up on the side. That is a normal sleeping bag. cooking instructions what am I talking about washing instructions uh, in German so you've got a bit of homework for yourself but you know the picture set pink a thousand words yeah. and it's just it's just a dense fibrous so there's, the, the, there's no down in there I, I don't I wouldn't think it's waterproof I, I wouldn't like to say I couldn't tell um, yeah so the proof in the pudding is in the eating, as you would say. Well, that's what I need to know, a bit of food. So we'll come back in a bit and um, see how we go. Right, back in town now. Here we are. All set up there with the tarp over the hammock with the under quilt and the Austrian sniper sleeping bag. So, time for a little pick-me-up. So, the hammock came from Aldi. So this is quite a little box for all my gizmos. First of all, Swiss Army bucket and water bottle set. And we're going to assemble the outdoor kitchen bush box. 
with Tranja. Give it something. And the top half, I'm able to jam in all my all my stuff really. Whether it be chicken, mushrooms, hot chocolate, coffee, mashed potato, even some protein oats, golden syrup for the morning. But for now, I'm just going to go for a coffee. So, the bush box. Very small, but nonetheless, does what it says on the tin. And it, all it is, three bits of metal, all on its tod. One, two, one, two, three. It's all done by friction, so you shouldn't have any problems assembling it at all. The last words he says, it springs out everywhere. There you go, ready to go. Preloaded with lit spirits. That's lit. What you can do, you can go on the top or the bottom, it's up to you. But you shouldn't need it. I don't think so anyway. One cup of coffee. Give that some time to bloom. And we're away. I'm able to um, cook up all manner of things dead easily. Let's see if I can go on there. Right, come back to me, five or so minutes, get yourselves a nice cup of Kenko and um, discuss what we're going to do next. So, about the weird camera work, I've got it on the selfie stick in my hand. So, um, come the end of the night again. It's been good so far. I had good company. I'll see you in the morning. Um, as, as you can sort of see. One last drink before the end of the night, which I've just had, lovely. And one more. This is from a subscriber. Thank you very much, Elliot. Oh my god. Some spiced rum. Ooh. Thank you, Mr. Davis. Very good indeed. So now it's time to crash into my Austrian sniper's sleeping bag and the hammock and the ender quilt and everything else. And I think it's gonna be a good night. I'm not gonna freeze to death like last time. It's quite mild tonight. So it's time for me to knock it on the head. And, um, see you in the morning, eh? Good night.
morning. That was a wonderful night's sleep. Slept all the way through. And I think it is to do with being cocooned in this hammock with the under quilt and I think to do with the um, Austrian sniper sleeping bag very warm but also cool in the right places plenty of space Goldilocks, not too hot, not too cold. Superb. And this is the good filler. Thought I could be here for hours. Hours and hours. Listening to nature wake up. Gazing at the golden hour of the morning. Blue skies tinged with pink clouds. Wonderful. Absolutely wonderful. But time waits for no man. It's time for me to get some breakfast organised. A lovely cup of coffee. But oh. Oh. my slippers on. I'm not a savage, you know. I'm a gentleman. So I think thoughts are in order on this. Yeah, you're definitely coming out of me again. You really are. Can't remember how much it cost. Forty pounds or so. Um, oh, value for money! But the freedom to move, to put your toes out, to put your arms out. Very good. Very good indeed. Right. I think I. Try and get out of this. I can't do it gracefully at all. Um, so, you know, but, um, I will. You know what? For a bit of late night jauntry to the um, evolutions, if needed, or to get it quickly, these are ideal as well. Right, um, catch me in a minute.
protein oats, golden syrup, just add water. And all I've done on this is sort of those little cup of things you get from the supermarket without having to carry the cup which is going to be breakable. I can do this. Condense it all down. I'm not just eye candy, you know. Right. While that boils, I'll um, start to break down camp.